Well, greetings on this Thursday, September 28th, September nearly over. Hopefully that means we're getting closer and closer to the end of hurricane season. We shall see headlines today of a storm of another type. Uh, former Governor Nikki Haley, South Carolina Senator Tim Scott, longtime friends, longtime Republicans in South Carolina, both running for president. Last night's debate saw them for the first time uh, actually do some exchange with each other, with Tim Scott going after Haley and Haley responding. Got lots of coverage of that debate and that particular issue at the TMD.com today. We also have news today of some reorganization in, in the administration and recreation departments at the city of Orangeburg. We suggest you take a look there, some uh, interesting developments with some people that you're going to definitely know. Town of Utahville looking at ways to prevent flooding damage, which uh, flooding in the eastern part of the county has long, long been a problem. We are also, I do today, urge you to read a story called Fly, Eagle, Fly. It is a column by Dr. John Rainey about, uh, honestly, begins with the cruelty of people to an animal, notably our national symbol, the ball eagle, and the effort it took from a lot of other really good people to make uh, this rescue of this bird a reality. Matter of fact, you could, some would call actually the rescue of this bird and its release after rehab a definite miracle. Latest high school football poll, class A schools, you're going to have a lot of interest in that in the TND region. HKT, unbeaten, ranked number three. Bamberg Earhart, number six, one loss only to Denmark Oler. And Calhoun County's only loss is to HKT. They are ranked number nine. Miles to go yet in that race, but we are getting late in the season when uh, every game is going to count in the playoff uh, picture. Take a look at the TD.com. There's a lot more there. I'm just giving you highlights. I uh, want you to become a member. We need your support and have a great day.